Have you ever wondered how long it takes the average woman to reach climax? I'm Dr. Rena Malik, urologist and pelvic surgeon, and today we're gonna talk about what the average length of time it takes for females to orgasm. If you're new here, I make urologic content every week, Monday and Friday, making videos on bladder health, sexual health, and so much more. If you like what you see, make sure you subscribe and share this channel with your friends. So how do we know what is normal or average? Well, in fact, there's been a couple of studies looking at how long it takes women to reach climax. The first study was done in the United States and Hungary with a community-based sample of over 2,000 women. They asked these women how long they estimated it took them to reach orgasm during partnered sex, during ma masturbatory sex, and if they had any difficulties with orgasm. And so all of these 2,300 women were given a survey asking about their medical history, their sexual history, their typical information about orgasm and arousal, as well as any orgasmic difficulties. And what they found was that orgasmic difficulties were more common in women who had anxiety and depression and also had a partner. Of those 2,300 women, only 8% said they never masturbated. And what they found was that the average time to reach climax in women with a partner was about 14 minutes. However, when they masturbated on their own, that time was about eight minutes. So what does that tell me? Well, women are doing a better job pleasing themselves during masturbation because they clearly know what they enjoy. If you've watched my video about female anatomy, you'll know that the clitoris is actually homologous to the penis in development for both men and women or penis owners and vulva owners. Very often women need clitoral stimulation in order to reach orgasm and very often when masturbating women focus on clitoral stimulation. The other reason that authors in this article mentioned why women may orgasm quicker during masturbation is because during sex, women are more focused on intimacy and trust with their partner, whereas masturbation is primarily 100% for pleasure. Despite the difference in the time it takes to reach climax, the majority of women in this study found partnered sex more satisfying than masturbation. Those with orgasmic difficulty, however, were a little less likely, about 44% compared to those without orgasmic difficulty, where 75% of women found that partnered sex was more satisfying. Interestingly also, women who were older and had a very satisfactory relationship status were more likely to have shortened orgasmic latency time or shortened time to climax. This makes sense, right? Women who are older or been in a relationship that they're happy in can communicate better what they like and understand their bodies a little bit better so they can reach orgasm more quickly. And as one might expect, longer time to orgasm was associated with distress and difficulty with arousal. Another study published in 2020 actually took it a step further. They recruited women to measure their time to orgasm with a stopwatch over a period of eight weeks. They recruited 645 women across multiple countries, including the US, UK, Netherlands, and India. And it was estimated that it took somewhere between six and 20 minutes for women to reach climax during sex, with the average being 13.4 minutes. And 17% of the women in the study reported never experiencing orgasm. And when asked if penetrative intercourse alone was sufficient for orgasm, the large majority said no. Up to 69% of people needed additional clitoral stimulation to reach orgasm. So I hope this video answered the questions that you're looking for. As always, we're going to take care of yourself because you're worth it. <laughs>